Cape Cast. We had the chance to visit with Caleb Potter and his mom, Sharon Lindsay, at their Wellfleet home the other day. Caleb, you remember, was injured in that awful 4th of July 2007 skateboarding accident in Wellfleet. That's the skateboard right there on top of it. Pictures uh, from his life. Caleb has been making great strides, working back from uh, the brain injury uh, he suffered. And now he's getting ready for a big art show. It's a benefit art show for folks on the Cape and beyond with brain injuries. And we had a chance to talk to Caleb about the opening, the art, and everything. So, 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 Caleb, like, oh, yeah. t- talk about this art thing. I mean, this is uh, this is a big deal. You got a big show coming up. Uh, you got pictures that you've done over here. They look great. They look really nice. But you got more to do because the show's coming up. So uh, this picture right here is the best. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Woo! That's the beautiful artist guy at work, but he's on deadline here. He's got to get better believe it. the paintings done. So, what are you trying to get into now? Is it uh, looks like there's a rose involved. Uh, yeah, what? I'm gonna try to put that rose on the paper as as best as I can. May it actually look as pretty as the real rose. Well, good luck. Uh, I'll give it a try. Hey, good luck, thank you. It's a tall task. Yeah, so, it is. <laughs> tell us about life. What's going on? How you feeling? I've been better, but not bad. I'm still somewhat happy and healthy, and and life can't be better without hanging out with my mom. Having a good time, yeah. pretty much. Yeah, pretty good time. More or less. It's been a, a bumpy few years, right? Yeah, it has. Bumpy and lumpy. How do you sort of... Made me grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. No kidding. No kidding. I mean, like, what do you think? When you think back on all that and the jumble and the change and the, you know... There's the skateboard right there. The, there it is. Darn it. Ah! You know, I mean, how do you try to put it all together and, and think about, like, what went down and why it went down? Uh, I wish it didn't go down, but it did go down because I was a, a, a foolish skater punk, I guess. I don't believe that, but... Nah, man, you were full of life downtown. Come on. Yeah. It was all a good vibe down there. Yeah. I don't know, I just got a little crazy and, and it didn't work out. Whoops. Whoopsie. But it's going to be all right, right? Yeah, it'll be all right. I'm healing and I'll be back to normal. I'll be back on my skateboard in no time. Oh, dear. <laughs> Let's just get this rose painting done, man. Yeah. <laughs> One step at a time. All right. Thanks. <laughs> Now, Sharon, why are you guys calling this event Tiaras and Ties? This is break out your hottest outfit and show up. I want these kids to really be celebrated. We got it, right? All right, so you have to look good at this event. And this is like a sort of fancy art opening. People should dress to the nines. the real deal. Okay, Tiaras and Ties, April 16th, 5 to 7 p.m. at the Harmon Gallery in Wellfleet. That's right. Be there. Better believe it. Yeah! (laughs)